Hi, this is Brennan, uh, Aim High Comics, and uh, I got a package today um, from a viewer, and he used to be a YouTuber, and I actually just got finished watching a bunch of his videos. He hasn't made a video in like three years, but uh, he had some really good. I'm talking about uh, Ferengi 102. Ferengi 102 sent me a nice letter. Um, Watch his videos, and uh, they were good. He's even got some stuff. He had haul videos of stuff that's hot now. That wasn't hot necessarily hot then, but it's hot now. So, um, yeah, hopefully he makes, uh, he'll start making videos again. He had some good stuff. Um, anyways, uh, he's watched my videos, and he messaged me and said he had something on my list, my top ten list for the, this year, and he sent it to me. And uh, it's an awesome shape. And... Um, yeah, I'm just very thankful that he sent this to me. Um, you know, I, I can't, you know, tell you how much I appreciate, you know, you sending this to me. Uh, it's a big deal, especially something on my top ten list. That's, that's, you know, that's huge of you, man, and I really appreciate it. Uh, I'll definitely send something to you. Um, uh, it'll probably be a few weeks because I'm about to start moving. But uh, he sent me Detective Comics 850. And this was on my list. So, at number seven there. These were no in particular order, but he sent it to me. So it's something that I can mark off the list. And I will mark it off right now. But thank you, brother. I really appreciate it. Awesome, awesome cover. I've never seen it in person. Um, but it's a beautiful cover. And, um, uh, the Marcus decided that this is the first appearance of uh, Gotham City Sirens. Um, so this is this is huge on my list. I am knocking out my list uh, a little faster than I thought. I actually didn't um, think that I would get through this list. Um, Conan 23 is probably in reach. Lois Lane 70 Detective Comics 359 and Caliber Presents number one. Probably a little out of reach. <laughs> um, but I'm closing on the house July. I'm scheduled to, to close July 25th, but I may close early uh, just because everything is on my end is super good. Um, so hopefully I get to move in uh, early. It'd be nice. Um, but yeah, once I get in, because I've already started packing already, uh, so once I get uh, to my house, I'm definitely going to send you a package and check out for Ringing 102. Um, uh, he had some good videos. I hope he starts making them again. Anyways, um, the next thing, I uh, went to Little Rock on vacation with the fam and hit up some spots, hit up a, a comic shop and didn't really find anything. It was picked through pretty good. They had a large selection of back issues from the past like 10 years. It was just, it was picked through. There was no, there was no Del Auto. There was no Adam Hughes. Like it was just, you get to that number and then it skips all those numbers. So someone's, someone's keeping up with the times. Uh, there was no Lucio Perullo, nothing. So what do I like to do? I like to go hit up a flea market or antique store. I call around, and sure enough, I call this one place. And yeah, we got some stuff laying around. Um, I think he's got prices on it for like five dollars a piece. Okay, so hit up this uh, this flea market. Go over. It's a very small box, not much in it. It's got a mixture of some new stuff and some old stuff. So this is what I found for five bucks a piece. Okay, first off, we have Original Sin number four. This is the first appearance of Silk. And it is near mint. Yeah, it's uh, it's clean. But yeah, I can't believe I found this in an antique store, flea market, whatever. But it was uh, first appearance of Silk. So, I don't even know how much this is going for, but I know the cover. Um, the next thing I found which is a big deal right now, or it's becoming a big deal, um, is they're making a Dark Phoenix movie. Uh, so I found in that one of those boxes, Uncanny X-Men 135. 
First appearance of Dark Phoenix. $5. And I don't know how much this is going for. I have no idea. I haven't looked at it. But cool cover. A few little ticks there. But um, overall, it's in, in pretty great uh, condition for the age. Um, I think it'd be hard to find 9.8s and Uncanny X Men's this early in the series, but I know they're, I'm sure they're out there. And then the last one I got, which is small, but I mean, I found this, there was like two small boxes, very small, or they weren't even short boxes. Probably was, there's like a half a short box if you put all that in the short box. Um, another thing I found was a near mint copy of Watchmen number one, first print. Um, I would have added this. This, if I had a top 11 list, this would have been number 11. Uh, it was between this and something else, but uh, Watchmen's big right now. I've always wanted this book. I had the trade back and I wore the, the cover off of it because I love that, uh, love that story. And the movie was okay. I mean, it was it was eye candy, but it didn't quite stick to the story like it should have. But uh, I mean, I liked it. Anyways, for speculation purposes, um, besides me just wanting this book in general, um, their HBO is going to make a show out of Watchmen. And so, just an update for you, if you haven't heard, you might want to start grabbing... If you see these Watchmen number ones around, there's going to be an HBO show. So start grabbing. I mean, this is maybe the second or third one I've seen, and I just never pulled the trigger because I didn't like the price. Well, this was five dollars, and it's near mint. I mean, it's it looks great. It looks perfect. So awesome, awesome book. And that's it. Um, small but deadly. <laughs> um, I hope to do another haul, maybe. I'd like to go through them this weekend. Just depends. I gotta ask my wife uh, what she wants to do this weekend. But I may find something to do. I'm well, trying to go, trying to schedule a time to go to my secret spot that I've told a couple of people about. Um, I want to see if it's actually a legit secret spot before I, you know, pump it up too much. Um, it's in Louisiana. Um, Hopefully, it, hopefully it's all what someone has told me it is. But uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, just want to thank Ferengi again, 102. Uh, awesome, awesome dude. Really appreciate it. Like I said, I'm going to send you something. Just let me get... I packed up a bunch of my stuff, so just let me get you know moved in. I'll send you a box, brother. Um, for sure. Um, yeah, just awesome. But... Uh, Hope you like the uh, the background here. People seem to like the outdoor videos. Uh, it's just something different. Uh, and it is pretty here. I mean, here. Maybe, maybe you're interested. It's, it's pretty out here. Anyways, thanks. Thanks for watching, guys.